Hello everyone, and after so long of not posting anything, I'm back with another episode, or part, as I would call it, I would call them episodes, of Let's Play The Sims 4 Vampires. Alright, so, basically, what happened in the first part is that I introduced her. That's all I did. That's seriously all I did. And that's terrible. So, I haven't gotten a lot of time to actually record this, but I found some time. I found some time. Nailed it. Okay, so I tried to record this part, like, a month ago. And, and let me tell you something, alright? I tried to record it, and that wouldn't work. So then, now, her, uh, vampire level, vamp, 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 skip. I don't know why her charisma is all the way up, and I don't know why her program is, is all the way up. I don't know what I did in the past, whatever, but her vampire lore skill is at four now, apparently. Apparently my UI isn't good either. Okay. Okay, just, just gotta, um, do this real quick. Get rid of that. We don't want that. Master volume definitely up. Voice is up a little bit. Okay, okay. I don't know how loud this is going to be compared to me to you, so doing my best here. All right, all right. So she just woke up, and we have our bed. We don't have a coffin, but she is a vampire, so, and we have 4,000. We have 4,995. So basically, what I think we're going to do is okay, so I've tried to explore this area. Every single time, and we're gonna wait until it's dark outside. And I also, I remember me, mate, like drinking out of multiple people. Like, and I turned, we turned. She has offspring, I believe. Okay, so, and also, and also, we got this long line of people now. All right, so basically, she's met. Vladislaus. So Vladislaus has spoken to us. Lilith Vittore. She has come by, I believe. She's a neighbor. Caleb. He's come by. He's spoken sorry to us. That. Family member came in. <laughs> All right. So, um, yeah, sorry about that small pause there. Okay. So, basically, we've met some people, and some people are our offspring. Like, Lily, I believe that she is our offspring now. And, uh, Jeffrey here, he might be, but I'm not exactly sure. Okay. Jin- Okay. Okay. Jinji? Is that- I don't know. I don't know. He, I believe, is our offspring. And we met Elena Strahd, and we met- We met Victor Fing- Nancy, yeah, we're definitely, yeah, we uh, drank out of her, as you can see there. It's disliked. <laughs> All right. And our vampire needs, we have two power points. We are a minor vampire. We're going to be a prime vampire soon, apparently. And I guess my vampire powers that I picked was Vampiric Charm. And it makes her all the more effective at the game of love. Ooh, makes nearby Sims find Carmen attractive. What I kind of want to do here is have a mix of two families. What I want to do is get Vladislaus's son to maybe marry Carmen. Like, I think that would be cute. <laughs> um, I think his name's Vladimir, right? Vlad, yeah, I think it's Vladimir. Uh, we can detect a person's we can detect ugh, we can detect a sim's personality. We have a bat form. We could cast a hallucination. Oh, and we're eternally welcome. We have we can use less vampire energy. This I can't read today. And will occasional Carmen will discuss others because she hisses uncontrollably. And we're gonna use our two powerpoints and get a cult disciple. To study and practice, Carmen has reduced the amount of vampiric energy needed to fuel her powers. Continued study will yield even more greater efficiency. Alright, so we can't really do much since it is, you know, early in the day. So I guess I can show you around. 
All right. So we cannot walk outside because, as you know, we will burn and die. And let's see here. I did not get to show you guys this. So when you enter Forgotten Hollow, I almost forgot the name there. When you enter Forgotten Hollow, there are a lot of places around here that's really, like, it's spooky. It's definitely spooky. So, so you just go in here. Just gonna put everything up. Chat with. She's gonna chat with someone. All right. So you have our little house here, which is terrible, and we have this little planter thing. Probably because we're gonna try to, you know, plant. I don't. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna plant. I mean, we can't plant garlic because if we plant garlic, we're, you know, we might. We're gonna get really upset from that. See, there's wild garlic plants. So if she were to come over here and pick this up, she would get a moodlet for like for uh, being around garlic. I can't. I couldn't like get a word out there. All right. So this is so like a this is the uh, garlic clutter house. I believe that's what it's called, and it's basically just a haven of garlic, as you can see, garlic everywhere, garlic as the eye can see. <laughs> and we have these little shrines every everywhere in in here. This one's pretty. I like this one. This one's cute. Like I would yeah, that's that's a nice one. Oh wow, Geek Con is in town, guys. Let's go to Geek Con. No, we're not going to Geek Con. I'm sorry. We might we might do that some at some point. Like just kind of can like go around the um San Machuno because you know, why not? There's a lot of fresh necks there to bite on. And here is Vladislaus's little statue in the middle of town. Like, like seriously, like how, like, like, ooh, wow, Vladislaus is wondering if you want to go over to his house and hang out. Yes, we do. Yes. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We are going to go to Vladislaus's house and be... You know, super romantic, right? With his son, Vladimir. I just took a drink of something. I'm sorry if you heard me drinking on something. Very sorry. Alright. So this should load pretty quickly. I don't really want to skip out of different parts just for, you know, me to get to another area. So... As I was saying in the beginning of this part, I have tried and tried and tried to record this specific part and it wouldn't work. And then I'm trying to record The Sims 2 Let's Play right now also. So that one, The Sims 2 Part 4, Part 4 should be up sooner or later. I'm going to have to record it and then I'm going to have to just edit it probably a little bit like this video. <laughs> And then that will that part will go up, and I have to do thumbnail work. I love making thumbnails for The Sims Two and The Sims Four. Those are great. All right, Strahd Mansion, Count Vladislaus the something, the something. Okay, we need to get in there. We have to go. Um. All right. All right. All right. Oh no. Okay. Okay. We need to. Fly here as a bat. That'd look cool. Get in there. Go. Go. Okay. Oh, we're cute. Why isn't he... Get inside, Vladislaus. Okay. So, I'll show you around the Vladislaus mansion, I guess, now. Alright, here's their cute little dining room. <laughs> here is their piano. It's kind of weird. They have a piano. And an organ. And an organ, just you know, the the pipe organ. <gasps> hey, and Elena's here, so we could talk to Elena a little bit. We can brighten her day. We'll compliment her house. This is a nice house. I mean, I'll give it to EA and Matt. I don't know who would probably a sim guru, guru made this house, but I mean, this is an amazing house. Like seriously, is it in here? No, it's not. Okay, vampire offer vamp. Vampiric training. I don't know why they're still, you know, like, fledglings. If they are still fledglings, I'm kind of angry about that. I mean, I'll have to change that, like, tonight. 
<gasps> oh my gosh. I didn't see him. I didn't see him there. Okay. Vl oh yes. Get it. I don't know why my- Get it. This is nice. I like this. Right. Talk to Vladimir. Alright. Enchanting introduction. Yes. This is great. I'm s Oh wow. Oh wow. This is great. This is fantastic. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, Vladimir. Ooh, yes. Ooh, we made Vladimir flirty. Insult yard! Okay. Okay. There are gravestones in the yard. I'm not... <sighs> okay, get out of the way, Elena. I'm so sorry that we're gonna be intruding on your... Talking with your... Brother here, but... You know, we're just trying to become friends with vampires, and maybe not just friends with Vladimir, because Vladimir is beautiful. <laughs> oh my gosh. Compliment his outfit. He does have a nice outfit. Ooh, wow. Caleb. So my neighbor just texted me that the GeekCon Gaming high score has been broken. You want to come hit the emotion gaming mats? Matt's with- oh no. Okay, well, we didn't read it fast enough, but no, because we're with the Strods, and the Strods don't like you, so. We're not gonna like you if the Strods don't like you. We can't vampiric train him, right? Okay, okay, yeah, so he is, I think. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's a Grandmaster Vampire, and so is Vladislaw, so- Of course, Elena is only a fledgling va vampire, so that must mean that in her backstory, there was something there. She either just didn't want to practice the life of being a vampire, or she just kind of turned into one. Ooh, we could do a vampire spar. We'd have to go outside for that, so. Romance. Flirt. Flirt. Flirt with Vladimir. Browse web. Don't browse the web. Oh my gosh. Okay. Flirt. Yes. Yes! Okay. Show off our powers that are terrible compared to his. I don't really like his voice now that I'm hearing it. Like, speaking to us and everything, I'm not really enjoying his voice. Like, at all. Platoni. We can make a, um, a terrible, like, sim singing video. Can you not? <laughs> can you not? Like, we're trying to get with your brother here, and here you are stepping in front of him. No. No. And Vladislaus is getting it over here, man. Look at him. Yeah. Oh, wow. Now he stopped. Yes. Alright. Torka choosing? No. No. Okay. Romance. Embrace him. See if he will embrace us. Because if he won't, that's going to be sad. We just want to marry you. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay. Let's just, um... Get in here. That's, uh... Thumbnail. <laughs> okay. Um, there we go. Finally. Brighten day. Let's brighten his day a little bit. And compliment his house. More like your dad's house, but, you know. And the funny thing about vampires in this game pack is that vampires don't age. So, you know, Vladimir here could be, like, a thousand. <laughs> and probably Vladislaus is, like, way older than Elena and 
Vladimir. So, I mean, that's one of the best things about this pack is that you can actually be like a real, real vampire. Oh, wow. Let's show off our terrible powers. He's probably not impressed. Did you see that? Did you see that little, like, like, wow, you, you suck. Wow. No, uh, Vladimir. Maybe Vladimir just isn't good at this. This is great music. Ooh, good vampire. Make five friends. Don't drink deeply for five days in a row. So we got one day done. So, hmm. Express admiration. And then we'll, let's see here. Hug him. Of course. Romance. Compliment his appearance. And embrace him. Okay, so I'll show you guys around. So here is the Vladislaw's Vlad 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 the Strahd Mansion. Okay. So I'm guessing this isn't Elena's room. This this recording keeps cutting off, which I'm having issues with right now. So if there's a lot of skips in this video, I'm really sorry about that. Um, so this is Elena's room, I'm guessing. Just because, you know, it's purple and she has kind of like that purple vibe going for. And she has windows in her room, which I think is kind of terrible because she's a vampire. Or at least she maybe wasn't a vampire in her past before okay, so you know my recorder does not want to work with me right now so what that means probably is that i will have to end up buying a new recorder soon buying one so yay well i was showing you the basement so as you can see here it's really they have another pipe organ they have a coffin they have another coffin and i'm guessing that this is vladislaus's can't wait to see you. Oh, that's a good one right there. Let's go down here. Whose who's epitaph is this, though? Like, so I'm kind of guessing that it's um, Vladislaus's. No, I'm guessing it's Vladislaus's uh, coffin. This one is probably is Vladimir's. Like, seriously, like, I bet, I bet, though, I, like, if you're really thinking about it, I bet. Vladislaus would give his son a better coffin than that. And then there's another one. So there's all three. All three of them. Why does that need to feed? From low thirst. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, emergency. 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 <laughs> all right. Okay. What can we do here? Because we need, we need food. We need something. Do they have, uh, what, oh my gosh. Open it. There's nothing in the refrigerator. Okay, do they have a computer? I don't think their house would be that, like, updated to have a computer. I, like, like, seriously. Um, they... They don't have a computer, so we might be screwed. Okay, so, or maybe we're going to have to step out here. And we are going to have to feed on someone. I mean, we can do this. We can do this really quickly. I'll drink. All right, and then come on, come on, get off your phone, get off your phone, get off your phone. We're gonna die. We're gonna die here. Go home. Just, just us. Maybe not just us. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh. 
This is terrible. Okay, I'm gonna skip this part now. Alright, so we are back, and she is in her vampire form. We almost fed on someone, and then boom, just straight up done. How about we, um, Buy some plasma on the internet because, you know, we are going to burn and die. And if we die, I really don't know how I would be able to get back from that. Or maybe we can't. Um, there's a plasma fruit tree somewhere around here, right? There's something. There's something. There is. I know there is. I know there is. I know there's one. So come on, dear, please. We've been a good little vampire so far, okay? What the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay. Fly here as a bat. Sorry, Vladimir, we're leaving you, bud. Here we go. <laughs> I'm about to turn on cheats. I'm I'm serious about this. She's a small drink. Oh my gosh. Come on, you gotta let us drink. Nailed it. Right in time, too. Thank you. Drink plasma. Compel for a small drink. Let's just drink for everyone. We're, we're here now. So why not? Oh my gosh. Cute. Why do they make those noises when they're being, like, drank from, though? Like, that's the weird part. Okay, so if you compel for a deep drink, they fall on the ground. Which is weird. But it kind of makes sense. Dark meditation. Can we do that right now? Vampire. Dark meditation. Cute. All right, we got some of our vampire energy back. Vladimir didn't leave. Yes. Okay. Express admiration. Vladimir, get off the computer. This is probably why they don't have computers at their house, because they're old. I think they'd be cute together. Definitely. Definitely. I mean, Vladimir's original thing was to be like the Don Lothario of Forgotten Hollow, but now that he's met our beautiful Carmen Pierce, then does he really want to be the Don Lothario of Forgotten Hollow? <gasps> you know, we could do that here. In this part, we could. We talk him. Ooh, we could have a vampiric spar. We can spar with him. Or get training. Mm. I'm not gonna ask him to move in. Vampiric spar. Let's do that. 
Mist. He's using mist. Okay. All right. Oh my gosh. We all know she's gonna lose. That's cute though, like they help they help them up. That was cool. That was cool. That was really cool. <laughs> Where did he go? Is he Oh wow, he just left right after that. Wow. Well, you know what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna end this part right here. So this part in included terrible cutting off because I don't know why. It included us being with Vladimir Strahd. I think we're gonna probably marry him. Probably. Probably. Uh, I showed you around the Strahd household and maybe the next part we're gonna show you, I'll show you around the Vittores. So, and maybe Caleb Vittore just might want to be with Carmen too. So we'll have to try to figure that out. Well, I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye!